Hey guys, it's Kay from KS Anonymous and I am back today with another episode of r slash facepalm. Wasting no time at all. So this is a news story about how unfortunately a bar worker was shot and um, right behind him, <laughs> the place we must assume was the location on their, uh, <laughs> on their sign says bartender wanted <laughs> like <laughs> breaking news story <laughs> hey by the way can we get another one though like <laughs> i don't know why it just amuses me a lot imagine being this effing stupid i think it's pretty gross people breastfeed it's not milk it's body fluids might as well feed your little one your pee we have bottles and formula that's meant to feed your baby stop giving your body fluid a classy name by calling it milk it's not milk milk comes from cows it's almost like saying almonds make milk <laughs> idiots everywhere if you'll just uh could you just pull out a, a mirror real quick yeah. Yep. Oh, look, there's an idiot right there. Double work for same pay. If you're having a bad day, remember that we unloaded 6,000 bricks in the wrong address. <laughs> that had to be so painful to find out. Yeah, that's a way to meet God was painting my calipers for the new brakes and decided to paint the discs. Probably the best mod I've done. Looks so much better than crappy silver. Nice thick coat so it won't come off too much when I brake. For those that don't know much about cars, these are brake rotors. They need to be bare for more friction to stop the car. Painting the rotors means you will cover that bare metal and when you brake, you may not have enough friction to stop the car. When all the paint is gone, the paint particles will contaminate the pads and rotors, which affects the friction. For those who don't want to read, when car goes brrrr, car go bang. <laughs> oh, God. But like, how does this person not know that? Like, how does someone like dealing with their own brakes and doing something this dumb? Oh my God. What a difference. Magic comic effect. Install now. Your selfie versus cartoon effect. Well, you've now proven to me that your app is completely useless. Because there's no difference at all. <laughs> and people still think there are endangered species? Science page. Sometimes I forget just how big the Pacific Ocean is. And still there is people who think there are endangered species. What? <laughs> I don't understand. I don't understand. Gamer moment. Every gamer's reaction upon finding a blood covered room. Well, that's not good. I'm pretty sure that's not exclusive just to gamers. And then everybody debated whether this was a face palm or not, and then also debated whether gamers would actually react that way. So I'm gonna let you, you guys just feel how you wanna feel about this one. I think I see why this guy is working at McDonald's. Customers can't order half dozen McNuggets. I went to McDonald's. I looked at the menu and saw that you could have an order of six, nine, or 12 chicken McNuggets. I asked for a half dozen nuggets. We don't have a half dozen nuggets said the teenager at the counter. You don't? I replied. We only have six, nine, or twelve, was the reply. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, buddy. Buddy, buddy, a dozen means twelve. And, and half of twelve is six, come on, buddy. <laughs> oh my god. Well, at least this guy was trying. Question. For her birthday, I bought my girlfriend a very expensive, top-of-the-line nose and ear hair trimmer. I thought this would be a nice way of bringing to her attention a personal hygiene issue she doesn't seem to be aware of. To my surprise, 
She became hostile as soon as she opened the present and asked me if this was some kind of joke. <laughs> it's her birthday. <laughs> it's her birthday. Her birthday is not an appropriate time to suggest she needs to trim her nose and ear hair. <laughs> Five-star diagnosis, boys. Hole in roof may be cause of leak. You know, I think I think you <laughs> I think you might have that right. I want to learn pink. I teach man lessons. My wife teaches woman lessons. I will teach your son how to fight, bleed, groan. She will teach your daughter how to ballet, long hair, pink. Call us before it's too late. <laughs> How does one ballet long hair pink? I want to know. I am pretty sure men are too. Bulletin. Women in solitary confinement are lonely. $13,000 in tax funds used to reach this conclusion. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> That's terrible. I'm gonna say yes. Yes, I am. Do you have cable TV? Yes or no? Do you have a satellite dish? Yes or no? Are you male or female? Yes or no? <laughs> I mean, I feel like everyone's gonna hit yes on that. Well, not everyone, actually. So, I mean, I guess that's, you know, but what? Do, what's the next word? Like, are you human? Yes or no? <laughs> I don't know how to respond to this. How big is a 3x5 note card? Like, 3 inches the width and 5 inches is the height? I don't know how I forgot this. I mean, if you turn it, you're correct. If you turn it the other way, you... I... I guess? <laughs> oh. Yay! Congrats! Thanks, we're so excited! Have you picked out any names? I'm pretty sure we're naming her Rifle. Pronounced like Rifle. And that's spelled R-E-I-G-H-F-Y-L. Oh. <laughs> Why would you do that to your child? I love that. Oh. <laughs> well, somebody needs Jesus. Church closes food bank because it attracts poor people. Hmm. Funny. That's just so strange. It's like people who can't afford food might also be poor. 10 out of 10 cents. Today at 2.24 a.m. All is well. I heard something heavy fall down. Yes, mom. Everything is fine. Why are you still up? I just got up from you texting me. I had a teacher do this to me one time. We were on a school trip. We all had to be in our hotel rooms with our groups and we were all trying to sleep and we were on the verge of sweet, sweet sleep when our teacher called us and we finally picked up on one of the later rings because none of us wanted to answer the phone because we were all almost there asleep and she asks us if we're asleep. No ma'am, we are no longer asleep, thank you. Oh come on! How to wear a mask. Cover your nose and mouth. On your chin? Nope. On just your nose? Not quite. On just your mouth? Try again. Over your nose and mouth? That's the one. And sitting right underneath, <laughs> right underneath the sign is a guy who's only covering his mouth with it and not his nose. <laughs> So I guess he's Mr. Try Again. Girl on r slash Ita tries to make herself look better. My other classmates didn't say anything, so I think they were on my side, but didn't want to participate in this argument. I will ask them when they go back home. Anyways, I did end up leaving. Do you guys think I was the a-hole here? Please do not comment yet. Read this. 
Okay, I don't know how to explain this without being misunderstood, but could you guys do me a small favor? I used a throwaway account for privacy reasons, but the thing is, if this post blows up, there's a high chance for my friend to still see this. Could you please, instead of commenting, DM me if your judgment is YTA? I promise, if I get a lot of YTA DMs, I'm going to accept the judgment as per rule 3, but it's just weird if my friend sees this and sees YTA comments, especially after our last argument. You guys get what I mean, right? Thank you. Edit. Oh, come on, guys. This post if one in rising now. Can't you please do as I asked you? Would you be okay posting on the subreddit just to get comments full of YTA and your friends see them and laugh at you? Edit. Hey, mods, please check your inbox as I sent you a message. It's urgent. Edit. Okay, the mods responded about auto mod and they basically told me to suck it up and deal with it. Guys, please just do as I asked you. I accept my judgment. Do you though? <laughs> you made yourself look a fool in front of your friend in the first place, I'm assuming. Made yourself look a fool on subreddit and now you're <laughs> making yourself look more of a fool. <laughs> just let it go. Anyway, that is going to wrap it up for today's video. If you enjoyed it, go ahead and drop a like and let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Really quickly, I'd like to thank my patrons. Up on the screen, you should see my face palmers and my crazy case. <laughs> thank you all so, so much for supporting me in that way. If you're interested in becoming a patron, checking out the original posts from today's video, or sending me an email for possible inclusion in a future video. All of that information is in the description box, so be sure to check it out. And I'll talk to you in my next video. Bye!